Camille, you're a singer too, and you know. She no sure is. She's a great one too. I know. Singer, dancer, she's very musical. For as long as I can remember, every day, regular sounds, I turn into rhythm. She's different, she's beautiful, she's smart, she's oh, funny. Oh, tell me more. So how did this come to fruition? I mean, you're an internet sensation, you do this online. Um, so did you approach Prime Video or did they approach you? Um, I approached them. I've been working on, on a series of, of videos and music videos and compositions for many years and was simultaneously developing this story. And when I finally felt it was ready, I broke the story, developed the pitch with my co-writer and producer, and I shot a short that was a makeshift version of the opening scene of the film at the diner. And we brought that package directly to Amazon because I loved the films that, that they, were, they were producing at the time. Um, some of my favorites existed on the platform, both TV and film, and I figured this could be an incredible home. Um, and they got it immediately in the pitch and and this was about almost five years ago now um and here we are so just keep just keep fighting that's, yeah. the, that's the goal right that's right <laughs> and camila how did you come on board uh well they reached out to me to play isabella and um i mean the script was just so unique and unlike anything i'd ever seen i was like so inspired and excited by the idea of bringing representation to the brazilian community and as a Brazilian American. Um, and then, you know, when I met with Rudy, I told him, I was like, I, I think I have to produce this with you because the story really resonates with me in a way that I feel like I have so much more to offer than just performing. I, I have a lot of ideas um, on, you know, how I can contribute to this creatively. Well, that's awesome. Um, so you're a real life couple. So did this, the film's story, the love story kind of reflect or mirror what you guys went through in real life? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> you're watch, as you're watching Rudy and Isabella get to know each other, you're also watching Rudy and Camila get to know each other, mm -hmm. and uh, those lines often blurred in a really beautiful, <laughs> organic way, yeah. um, which made my life as an actor and first-time filmmaker far easier. Very easy. <laughs> Yeah, you have to, you know, the sounds, and then you put a puppet in there, so that complicates things, right? So what yeah. was it like bringing that to life? Well, I'd, I'd been working with the puppet in short form for many years, and, and um, there were a few elements that always needed to be a part of the film, and it was Diego the puppet, and it was my mother playing my actual mother. Those were, those were non-negotiable. Um, Diego naturally became a perfect representation of Rudy's consciousness and and uh, guide. And does it? I didn't know about uh, what you, the ailment that you have. Synesthesia is that what it's called? Synesthesia. Synesthesia. Sorry. Um, so it, you're bringing awareness to that too, because I I, I didn't know about it. You know, yeah, you feel I, like I, proud of that too as well. Yeah, absolutely. It took me years to know that there was a name for what I was experiencing, and that was so cool when. You know, Cammy came on as an actor and a producer, so we were developing the pages. And as she was asking questions about this experience and mm -hmm. condition, we realized the characters should also ask those questions. Yeah. Very reflective of educating ourselves as well mm -hmm. as telling the story. Yeah. Um, and do we expect an album soon or some kind of like musical <laughs> project? You look at from me. Either, from um, either of you. She's talking to you. Camille, you're a singer too, and you know. She no sure is. Either. She's a great one too. I know. Singer, dancer, she's very musical. Yeah, well, musical couple here, so nothing in the works, maybe a musical or something else. We'll yeah, a couple things together. brewing. Couple things brewing. <laughs> there is a Can soundtrack. We? There is Do a we soundtrack. Have something I don't know. I'm talking shit. Um, <laughs> there's a there's a soundtrack for this film that will be out very yeah. soon. That'll be announced where you get some tracks that were not in the film. Some bonuses. Oh, cool. All right, well, thank you so much. And like you said, it's nice to see representation. I don't really know, you know, I have, I have a Brazilian friend who probably she interviewed you last week, and so you don't know much about the American Brazilian community, right? So you're bringing awareness to that. Now you got three Brazilian friends. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> thank you. I like having you guys as friends. <laughs>